my car is leaking something. Like, really? Go fucking figure. Can I drive it? No, you can't drive it. This sucks. Babe, I don't know what else to tell you. I mean, you, you, it's got to get fixed. You can't drive it like that, so. Tomorrow's my birthday, and I'm going to have no car. You have Nicole. She has a car. You want me to call her? Yeah, I didn't even invite them to my birthday party yet, so you might as well invite them for me. Roger's calling. Roger! Congratulations is in order for you and uh, Nicole, I heard. That's awesome, man. I'm happy. What's the over-under on him being five foot? <laughs> What's the over-under on him being four foot is more like it. <laughs> Listen, I got to run something by you. Uh, Jay's birthday is tomorrow. She wants to go out to dinner with you and Nicole. Uh, for you, Raj, why not? Thank you so much. I will see you tomorrow. Mm -hmm. So we got it figured out. This is the plan. Let's get you out of here. I was just thinking, though, there is another option. You can take my work truck. You, you can't drive a stick, but I can teach you. Roger's like, let me try and teach you stick. You can do this. Jesus, manual locks and everything. It's old school like me. Your key goes in there. Yeah. I won't start. Because you have to push the clutch in and take it out of gear. Take the emergency brake off. Keep your foot on the brake. Push the clutch in. Put it in first gear. You know where first gear is? Okay. Yeah. Let out on the clutch real slowly. You'll start to feel it. Easy. Easy. Stop, 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 stop. Push the clutch in. OK, there you go. That's much better, much better. Jesus. I'm going. No, it's going. It's going. Are you serious right now? No. Was that a joke? I was not. Take your foot off the brake, put it on the gas, and let out on the clutch. Easy. Oh, my god, girl. Easy. Oh, that's easy? My shoe. <laughs> the hard part of driving stick is trying to concentrate on the clutch and the thing. All right, so I'm taking you now, because that was brutal. Hello, Roger. Pleasure to meet How you. How are you? How are you, sir? Let's go. Grab something. Oh, shit. I almost just broke the boost. Jenny, got you a cake. Aw. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Like it. It's nice. Baby, you want a drink? Make me a. What you got? I'll make you a stiff one. You yeah. want a Shirley Temple? Yes, Her please. Shirley. Happy birthday. To the three of us drinking. Where's my Shirley Temple, bitches? Listen. Your kid has zero chance of being a professional basketball player. Oh, yeah. <laughs> zero. Nicole. Roger, shut up. I'm being honest. I'm being honest. Yeah, I mean, Roger always goes there. But you know, don't freaking talk about my baby. I'll fucking slice your penis off. If your kid's tall, I'll take a paternity test. Yeah, right. Roger, I hope you have a kid like Simon Birch. <laughs> fucking. Oh, that will be great. <laughs> I look like a mom. You ready for the bachelor party? <laughs> you better you better start asking for permission right now for me, not for you. Danny, I'm putting in an official request right now for Gianni's bachelor party. It's in Vegas. No. no. We're going to be in Vegas, too. Jenny, can no, Roger not come? Together. See that? That's, that's real life right there. What is it that bothers you so if I win? Like, why would it be a big deal? I don't want some girl shoving her face and vagina See? in your face. I know what goes down at bachelor parties. I don't like it. I want a dirty skank grinding on him at Gianni's bachelor party. Oh. No offense. Well, no offense. I don't want anyone grinding on my man either. Guys get grimy ass strippers coming to their bachelor See? party. I'm, I'm like supposed you're to be like, oh, you're going him. there and you're not going to have tits in your face. There is nothing good that comes from bachelor parties. People get divorces before they get married on bachelor parties. Like, weddings don't happen because of bachelor parties. Fucking paranoia. What's that paranoia? Forget I am. That's, that's, that's truth. That's facts. You're not going to fucking out to the diner and hanging out you, and getting a glass of orange juice. that happened to you, it comes down to trust, for starters. And it doesn't happens, matter. It's still it the disrespect. Jenny's a psycho bitch for a girlfriend. She's just like, Roger, you're not doing anything. You're not going to the bar. You're not going to any bachelor parties. You know, I kind of feel bad for Roger. It's the disrespect, disrespect of allowing. To who? To, who? to me. But I wouldn't have a problem with you doing it. It's not going to be for another year and a half. Yeah. We're not married I, I for a while. I need to work on this shit for a year and a half. Jenny, you'll be engaged by then. If this keeps up like this, you won't yeah. be. That means she loves you. Why are you cool with it then? Because he would leave me if I was like that. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.